Boris Johnson again under pressure after a fresh picture published by the Mirror shows him standing near an open bottle of champagne and half-eaten packet of crisps, alongside staff members wearing tinsel and a Christmas hat. His MPs, as usual, showed their anger. The photograph referred to is all over social media. Everybody can see the photo. The Prime Minister is in the photo. So can I ask him again, will he refer to the, ma the matter to the police? Because this is not one of the parties already being investigated by the Metropolitan Police. In the last few minutes, a photo has emerged of the Prime Minister in Downing Street on the 15th of December 2020, surrounded by alcohol, food and people wearing tinsel. It looks a lot like one of the Christmas parties he told us never happened. After five of his member staff left number 10, Johnson keeps losing trust within his own party. The evidence does not look good, but we haven't seen the full evidence yet. So I maintain throughout this that I cannot and I will not defend the indefensible. What has apparently has gone on is appalling, but we need to get the full evidence so we can make a decision. Brazen excuses. The former Conservative Prime Minister, John Major, condemned the unbelievable excuses used to deny that rules were flouted, warning they are shattering the public's trust in politics. Unfortunately, that trust is being lost, and our reputation overseas has fallen because of our conduct. We are weakening our influence in the world. We should be wary. Even a casual glance at overseas comment shows our reputation is being shredded. Now, police are to begin contacting more than 50 people believed to have taken part in alleged lockdown busting events in Downing Street.